Well, hello and welcome to Kuma's Kitchen, and this is again a uh, introduction of a Master Chef patron. And things change in December, just before Christmas. Like before that, I had one Master Chef patron, and man, I appreciate Jason a lot because he has kept Kuma's Kitchen afloat. Um, but I was getting a little worried because rent was getting tight, and then suddenly, boom, two new master chef patrons you met one just the other day and now today you're going to meet another and it's actually a duo and this is matt and aaron and actually here i don't have a picture of matt and aaron but they sent me this this and i'll go over that in a minute all right so the cool it's a pretty cool story about how this all happened you see because aaron actually became the master chef patron but he did it for matt and it was a surprise and he said look i, I want to surprise my friend matt uh, the two of us are always watching your show, and I want his name coming up in the credits at the end. It's going to be a Christmas surprise. And that's why I made the white Christmas drink, because it wouldn't have been in time. The next uh, episode of Kuma's Kitchen wasn't coming out until Monday, which is the day after Christmas, uh, Boxing Day. And uh, so I made the other one so that they, they could uh, reveal it, so Aaron could reveal it to Matt on Christmas Eve. And uh, that worked out fantastic. But now the story of how, how all this, uh, all, you know, these two guys is fantastic. Because the two of them are both uh, kitchen managers in Ontario, in Canada. And uh, they met up once a long time ago at a um, get-together. And they just hit it off, uh, you know, like you do when you're at a conference or something like that. And they started uh, mucking back and forth with recipes and cooking. And they like pushing the boundaries on cooking. Now, what they do nowadays is they get together every Monday night. One of them hosts the other with a dinner. And it's always like pushing the boundaries on, on the dishes. And uh, then afterwards, well, they watch Kuma's Kitchen. How fantastic is that? Uh, they watch Kuma's Kitchen. They said they love my show because they like my humor, which is probably me dropping things and things like that. Yeah, I, I'm not, not the uh, safest chef in the kitchen. And... Uh, you know, the way I muck around with recipes, the, the things that I try, the my take on, on recipes. And I think because of their take on recipes and my take, I would love to get together with these guys. I could imagine the three of us in a kitchen. How fun would that be? So hopefully one day meet up with you guys. Oh yeah, back to the picture. So um, Aaron sent me this. It was from, uh, it's actually a composite of the two of them. So this person was made out of Matt and Aaron because for a while there, they were running a catering company together and this was the logo. Anyways, Matt, Aaron, man, you guys are really appreciated. All, I super appreciate all my, all my patrons because it's you guys who help, well, keep the lights on and all over in, in the studio and uh, keep the show going so I can keep making these recipes and getting them out there. So thank you very much. And yeah, I do hope one day the three of us can get together in a kitchen because that would be so much fun.